Hey everybody, Joshua Lara here. So today I'm going to be doing something again, once again that I have never done before. I'm going to be doing random gameplays on a, D a DS game. So as you can see, it's on the DSi, because it says right there, Nintendo DSi camera. So anyway, here's the game I'm going to be randomly playing. Sonic Rush. So yeah, this was, and I don't know if I said this before, but this was actually the very first Sonic game that I played. The, uh, and it was it was obviously a 2D Sonic game, so we are gonna be playing it. Unfortunately, I'm not gonna be doing a let's play on it because there. Well, I'll explain everything when I start. So anyway, let me just scroll to the top. And the, I I really don't want to do a let's play a let's play on this game because it there's no save files. It's all just one file, and to and to start over, you have to erase all your data, and I really don't feel like doing that. So, we are just going to be just playing some levels. So, let's press start. Let's go to gameplay. So, we are going to be starting off with Sonic. And also, this was the very first Sonic game to feature... Well, this was, this was the very first Sonic game to feature his Jason Griffith voice. After... So anyway, we are going to be starting Zone 1, which is like Leaf Forest, I don't know what it's called. I, I, I don't know what it's called, but we're going to be just, we're going to be doing Act 1 of the Zone 1. And as you, I don't know if you saw right there, but I got 99 lives. But yeah, so let's get started and boom! I really loved playing this game when I was young. Like, cause like I said before, this was the very first Sonic game I played. Oh, I can't do it. And and another thing is that this was the ver this was the first Sonic game to feature the to feature the boost the 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 boost. So we are going to be going into the special stage, and it features on the bottom screen. So I have to show you guys that, and I have to use the stylus to move Sonic around. So let's get started. This is actually pretty easy, but the but the the other the other special stages that you will have to face, they will get harder and harder. And there's a thing you have to do a trick shot, and I I succeeded once, so yeah. All right, and when you see those yellow lines, it means it means the first part is over. But so you you gotta get like 100 rings, and if you don't get 100 rings. You will, um, you won't be able to, so you won't be able to go on, but as you can see, I collected more than a hundred, so, yeah, I don't know if you can see it that well, but if you can just, yeah. Man, this is really, whoa, watch out for the spikes. More spikes. Yes. So we did it. It said right there I had to collect 200 rings and I did it. So yeah. So in this random gameplay, we're just going to be doing some stages from Sonic Story. And we're going to be doing some stages from Blaze's Story. So yeah, we, we finished the... Special stage, and I already got all the chaos emeralds, so yeah. Doing the special stage now is pretty pointless. No, whoa, wait, what did I? Oh, I pressed the wrong button. But I know you, you guys can't see on the button. Because th this game actually requires you to do 
both on the bottom screen and on the full screen. The big, the bottom screen and the top screen. So I'm trying to get a good angle. Let's let's just start at this angle. Yes. So the first stage is cleared. All right, so act one cleared. And we got yes. an A rank. So that's pretty good. All right, let's go on. So we are, we are gonna ignore act two and just go on to the boss of zone one. So yeah. So let, let's just do one stage from each zone and then do the boss. So yeah. So this is a boss with Eggman. So the goal the goal is to like when he does that attack, which he's gonna do it again. But oh wait, no. He's gonna do his, his special attack. So I'll show you. And jump and lift. So like with that big thing right there, I don't know what it's called. So look, look. When he does that, you have to jump and then there, you have to attack. So yeah, that's what you have to do. Oh, but you gotta watch out for when he does that. You can, if you, if you get hit by that, you'll easily die. No matter how many rings you have, you'll easily die. But if you get hit with just, if you get hit with just that hit right there. You'll just lose all your rings. You won't die, but you just gotta grab your rings as fast as you can. And for this attack that he's gonna do right now, you're really gonna wanna avoid it as fast as possible because like, he's gonna like screw up to you, and if he and if he pushes you off, you'll die. So yeah, uh, he's gonna. Um, so yeah, now I just need to hit him one more time. Okay, he's gonna do it again. Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh, wait, wait, what was Sonic? Oh, wow. Alright, yes! We hit him. So, we got him. Look at Sonic dancing. Oh, he killed that. Can we try this again? And we got an S rank. So we are not going to be doing all of the stages. We're just going to be doing some of the stages. So let's do. Well, let, well, we might do all the stages, but for now, yeah, let's just go on to Zone Two and do Act. Um, let's do Act One again. So, Water Palace. It starts on the bottom screen and goes to the top screen. Aw, oh, dang it. So, as I said before... Aw, oh, dang it. So, as I said before, this game requires you to use both the bottom screen and top screen. So, I can't just keep switching it up all the time. So we're just going to be keeping it up on the top screen. Oh! Dang it. Whoa. Let's move to the bottom screen. Loop the loop. And th this stage requires water, so you're going to want to avoid falling in the water. So if you stay in there for a long time, you'll drown. Alright, we got it there. Now look at him going down that water slide. 
Oh no, I didn't. Oh. So like I said before, you're going to want to avoid staying in the water for a long time. Because if you do, you'll drown. Move to the bottom screen because that's where I am right now. Get out of the water! Yes! Alright, we cleared the stage. And also, just so you guys know, I'm playing this on my DSi, not my original DS. See, I'm playing this on the DSi. And the rank is on the bottom screen. And I got an A rank. So, yeah. Let's do the boss. And look at Sonic speeding up right through there. Let me just get the camera angling good. So, like I said before, we're not going to be doing all the stages. We're just going to be doing some. Oh. So, what requires you to hit him is... Oh, hold on, just gonna. Okay, sorry about that. So my camera so sort of decided to, for well, like, flunk out on me and and was losing its control. So as I was saying before, he if you want to attack, you you have to wait till he gets in the middle, and you and then he's gonna lay his head down, and then you got to and then you hit that part like like he got in the middle again, and he just stays right there, and when he lays his head down, that's your move. Oh, and this is his sort of special attack kind of thing. Oh, that bastard! Oh, wait. And you know what's you know what's weird is that Sonic he doesn't drown in this. What's weird is that Sonic he doesn't drown in this. I mean, look, we're underwater, and he. Uh, look, we're under like we're, we're underwater, and Sonic isn't drowning. Well, he got out of the water there, but why? Is, I want to know why there isn't any air bubbles. Cause look, we're, we are literally underwater, and there's positively no way he can hold his breath for that long. But yeah, well, well, maybe that's a mistake that Sega made when they made when they were making this game. All right. What? Attack him! Oh, I missed him. And by one. Oh, dang it! Ha! Missed. All right. Wait till he and yes, we got him. I still want to know how Sonic can hold his breath that long. Alright, so now we are going to go on to Blaze's, Blaze's, Blaze's levels, like stages. So we are going to be, go we're going to go back to the main menu. And we are going to be playing as Blaze, the cat. So you can tell who Blaze is because she's right there. That's Blaze the cat. So we are going to be playing as her. Let me just get to the... And there we go. So now we're going to be playing as Blaze the cat. So let's play some of Blaze's levels. And instead of tails on the top screen, it's cream and cheese. Like cheese and cream. Like cream the rabbit. And so let's do let's do zone three, which is the the pyramid world. I don't I don't know zone three, well whatever you want to call it. So let's do act um let's do act one.
Alright, so we're on the bottom screen. What? Oh, I just, I died. And blaze and blazes attacks. Blazes attacks are kind of a little different from Sonic's, but yeah, it's pretty much the same. You could still uh, doing tricks and stuff. Wait! Oh, why did I jump off? I keep jumping off. Ugh. Let's just continue. I hope I don't fall off this time. <coughs> All right, Jack. Oh, that bastard! Knocked all my rings out. And usually this stays most on the bottom screen than the top screen. Oh, I was supposed to go on this screen. Also, her jumps are different from Sonic 2. All right, so it's on the back on the bottom screen. So when you see these parts, you have to defeat some enemies. I would prefer you just boost right through them because it'll be easier. Or you could just do that. Huh. Or you could, or you could just do that instead of boosting. Oh, why do I keep jumping off the... Oh, it's hard for me to get, like, an angle of the screen. Alright. So the more enemies that you defeat, the, the faster, the more your gauge will be up to. Wait, hang on a sec guys, I'll be right back. Okay guys, I'm back and sorry for that little blip, blip error right there. So anyway, we're back and we, as you can see we made it on to this little riding skateboard kind of thing. Well, it doesn't really look like a skateboard because it's way too... Oh, I didn't see that there. Alright, so you gotta just try to... You just, you gotta just try to make it to the goal from right here. And, oh, I didn't, I'm just trying to get the camera at a good angling so you guys can see the screen better. Okay. And enemies fall down from the sky, so you're gonna want to defeat. Oh, that stupid boulder! Yes, I made it. And we completed the stage. And of course, the results are on the bottom screen. We got a B rank, okay. So now let's do the boss. Let's let's do the boss.
And there goes Blaze. Alright, let's do the boss of Zone 3. And it's on the top screen, so yeah. Alright, so this guy is this it's Eggman. So he turned it he's like some sort of spider spider kind of thing. And as you can see he got a little boulder boulder thing kind of boulder thing right there. And the goal is that when he when he throws it, you gotta and it's going, you gotta hit it and then but sometimes they'll avoid it, but you gotta hit it and then bam it hits him. So you can't just like attack him from like where the spot you are. You can't just jump on him and attack him. You gotta hit the ball so you can attack him. But you gotta find the perfect time to hit the ball because that after a short time it hits the it hits the it, it turns into spikes. So yeah, you're gonna wanna avoid it at all costs. Like right now. And he jumped over it and he attacks and yeah. Now I just need to hit him two more times and this boss will be cleared. And of course he jumps. And bop. Oh, he's about to do his special attack. Oh, he didn't. <laughs> wow, this was so easy. So easy. Super duper easy. Alright, well that boss is cleared. Alright, let's see my grade. Never get on my bad side. And we got a S rank. Okay. Now we are gonna be we are gonna do one more. So let's do zone four. Wait, no, uh I, I really don't know what to do. So, uh, let's do zone one. So, let's do the, let's do act one. I just hope my camera doesn't turn off on me. So I, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna end it off soon. But this is the final stage that we are gonna do. So this, oh wait, what? Ah, oh, I screwed up. All right, let's try this again. Alright, watch out. Yeah. So this place looks like some sort of carnival. Oh, you gotta hit it? Okay. And I'm trying to hit it and it's not letting me. So let's just go down. Oh, so close! And oh, uh, come on, hit the hit the switch. Sorry, it's on the bottom screen. Let's just go on the. Wait, no, I didn't want to do that. Alright, so I think it won't let me. It's. Well, the thing is on the bottom screen, and it's not letting me. Oh, there. I touched it. Some of the stages require you to do some complicated work. 
such as this part. You gotta push down, you gotta press and hold the down button and it'll, it'll send you flying straight up. Wow. Oh, look at that ball. Okay, it's on the bottom screen. Yes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I hope we're almost to the it. Oh, I didn't see that there. What? How did that happen? Oh, I keep losing my rings. No! Okay, it's starting me from the spot I was already at. Dang it. 